So, you made the grave mistake of wearing your nice bullet seat to your uncle's wedding. And all your cousins have dipped, so you're the only one left to do this work. <sighs> it's okay, my friend. Colorful. Everyone's time comes. Lucky for you, we're back this week with some more tips. Uh, and our OG Yvonne has joined us again to help us study the sua. The presentation of the sua is the host family's way of showing appreciation to all the families that have spared their time to come to the funeral, wedding or birthday. Before the ceremony takes place, families will show support to the family of the bride, groom or the deceased person by bringing iatungas and money. This is called a si'i alofa and we have a video on what this process looks like in the description box. The sua happens after the ceremony has occurred and after everyone has either eaten their lunch after a burial or eaten their dinner after a wedding reception. A sua is also presented only to the highest ranking chiefs who have ali'i titles or ministers. The sua is reserved only for very important people. There are five components to the sua. The first is the new with the money inside or a coke bottle with money on top and a siapo or an iefapalangi. The second component of the sua is the tray with the plate of food, which also has taisi. Taisi may include yam and taro wrapped in coconut leaves and chicken, and sometimes it is different food items altogether. The third part of the sua is the presentation of the boxes of bisupo or corned beef, called pusa bisupo and samon. The fourth part is the presentation of the ietonga, and the last part is the presentation of the tiltusi or envelopes with money inside. These five parts make up what is known as the sua presentation, but today we will be showing you how to present the first part, which is usually the most nerve wracking because a lot can go wrong. This is the presentation of the new and the siapo, aka the coke bottle and the iefa'apalangi. It's just a way of saying thank you. So how is it different now than how you used to do it back in the day? In, in the olden days, they used the coconut drink uh, as uh, they knew and to begin with there was no money until people had money so somebody had a bright idea to put one American dollars which was a lot of money and now people have substituted with a bottle of Fanta, mm. a can of drink because it's easier. Yeah. Um, and what about the fabric on the arm and around yes, the waist? Yes, that, that was a siapo, a tapa cloth and it was usually just folded over the girl's arm. And even then, they, because uh, people are thinking, oh, we can do better than just a cloth here, we'll buy a big a bundle of that, 20 meter, 30 meter, depending. And then at the beginning, when I first saw that, it looked quite good because you got it here, and it was coming way back here, like at the back of Manhattan where the food is. <laughs> so along the line now, and I think maybe Kukwila, American Samoa, that's where I first saw it. They got the fabric, the whole thing, put it like that and put the drink on top, on top of it. Yeah. And it's a graceful walk. It's not a walk where you're in a rush. Well, there you have it. We're going to get started. Mm -hmm. God help us. Pardon? Nothing. So, we have our material and our new, aka Coke bottle. Coke bottle. Yes. Um, so, what do we do now? Now, put your hands straight. Why let more more? Pardon? Who's going first? Shot this to me. Yeah, love it, love it, love it. Put it in a little more gang and put that in here. Yeah, hurry up. Whoa, what a sassy guy. <laughs> is that comfortable I'm for you? Is that a doodle on me? I'm a bit sure. You're right. That's all right. Okay? Yeah. That's all right. Okay, yeah. Papel, listen to the MC, all right? Because you're ready. Papel, all MC. Yeah. Alumaya la usung al papel nainga. Well, I saw ya, kula fak mali. Lenge ya inga. Yeah, no, no. Yeah. Good girl. Give me five. Beautiful. This is another way, instead of going directly to the person, you come, this is how we do it in our church. And now uh, look where exactly where the person is, and then walk, turn. Now, wait a minute, don't turn and walk. It's not a marching thing. Once you turn, pause, now walk. 
pension is, even if we just fold it in half and leave it there, yeah, by the fang you turn lower. Yeah, that's that's how you present Levi Lolo, the first one. All right? Okay. Are you comfortable with that? I'm very comfortable. Okay, do you think you can do it without tripping over your, your oh, ear? Maybe. So if the ear is too long, just wrap it around again, just take one side and do it. Whatever you do, please don't tie it around. <laughs> We're not doing um, karate on that ear. <laughs> Why don't we tie it around? Because it was never tied in the beginning. Mm -hmm. If not, do what they do now. I hear, but take it there. Whatever you do, why do you want to tie your waist before? It, it doesn't look nice. Uh, if there's anything happening in your church or family, would you be comfortable and confident in doing it? Yes. I reckon. Yes, I'm so excited. Mm. Good luck and God bless. Thank, Thank you. you. We both know that we've had a lot of anxiety <laughs> about folding etongas and doing sua, so this will help a lot of young girls out there. So thank you so much. Don't forget, listen. Listen. Listen in time to do things. That's the most important thing for time more. Mm -hmm. Listen to whoever is doing it, and you won't go wrong. Exactly. All the best. Thank, thank you. you. So from us to you, that's our how-to tips and tricks. Come back again next week.